Okay everyone, in this tutorial we are going to learn how to use the application Pages in order to create a logo. First you click on the application. If you don't have it right here, you can go to Launchpad and then you find it over here. Somewhere right here, which is basically on the first page and you open Pages. It opens this page, so you click on New Document. And then you have Templates. You can either choose templates from here. I'm going to choose a blank one since I am creating a logo. First, let's take a look at this sidebar where you have format and document. This is everything related to the document and this is everything related to formatting the text and later on for other objects. If I am creating a logo, let's say something about Earth saving the planet, alright? I need to get some things that I can use from here or also I can go on Google and find information or PNG pictures. What I can do is the following. I start by going to shapes and I can search from here or choose from the categories. I have plenty of categories here and I can search directly. First, I'm going to choose Earth and you can find Earth from different sides so I'm gonna choose one of them. On pages, you have options to resize objects like that. You can also click on this and then you will be able to resize it from here as well. If you notice, I'm going to just undo. So edit, undo. So, and then I'm going to click on this to not mess it up. After this, you can go on style where you can color the earth. Once I'm done, let's say that I want to put some, another thing. But before I continue, when you are creating a logo, you want the objects that you are drawing to not be aligned with the text. So it is very important that you go on Arrange and you click on here, you make it none. This way, you are able to control it however you want. Now I'm going to start by getting an object. So I go to Basic, I want to get a circle. And now, in order to put this in the back, I need to go on Arrange and then over here, I need to click on Back. Backward is when you have many layers, but here I only have one object behind it. So I click on Back and there you go. Let's say that I want to bring hands. I want real hands actually. So over here in the shapes, I'm not going to be able to find real hands. So I will have to like go on Google. To refine my research, I can click on tools, type and choose clip art. This is a good example that I can use. So I'm going to click on it and it looks like a clip art because it doesn't have a background behind. I can find more examples over here if I want. I need to right click and click copy image. And over here, I need to right click and paste it. Group them so that I can move them together. Now I want to put a title. I need to use a text box. The text box is much better and then you choose a title inside it, this way. Now that I am done with my logo, I can click right here on file and I can export to PDF. This is how I can export it. 